Sunday, the elected members of the Congress party passed a resolution during the CLP meeting. The resolution, while thanking Gandhis and party president Malik Arjun Khadge for their guidance and relentless support through the campaign, also authorized Khadge to appoint the new CLP leader. Congress observers also held a one-on-one -on -one meeting with the MLAs asking their opinion on chief minister's choice. Earlier, Bengaluru, remember, witnessed a huge political drama because these top supporters of top contenders, D.K. Shivkumar Siddharamaya, hit the streets. They started to chant slogans for their respective neta. The supporters also demanded that their favorite leader be chosen as the chief minister of the state. So the supporters are out. The netas have said willing to talk. What will the high command decide? Take a look at this report about who possibly will Malikarjun Khadge. Under whose supervision, as a party president, the Congress has won the elections. Observers are meeting the MLAs. They are in Karnataka. Take a look at this report. Karnataka has said Namaskara Congress. And now the victorious party has the unenvious task of choosing its best bet for the chief minister's post. Congress is facing the problem of plenty with two top contenders for the top job. Sidramaya, the popular face with Mass Connect, and DK Shivakumar, the resourceful master strategist. Both sides have launched separate poster wars, flexing muscles to appeal to the high command. Supporters of both Siddha and DKS remain resolute in pushing their candidature. Siddha Ramaya, who may have an edge over DKS, spent the day meeting Congress Chief Kharge and a host of newly elected Congress MLAs. DKS, on his part, prayed at the Tumukuru Temple, which he had visited in the run-up to the polls and results. Congress is facing caste conundrum with Vokaliga Sears backing DKS as CM and Lingayat Sears too blessing him. Sidramaya on his part has the backing of his community, the Kurubas. Definitely uh, position for uh, uh, DK Shukuma CM position in the Karnataka government, very successful, no problem. We will appeal to Congress High Command. to announce CM candidate Sri D.K. Shukumar. But the key lies with the High Command, which has appointed three central observers for consultations with MLAs. After his Karnataka talks, Kharge is in Delhi to brief the Gandhis. The new Congress MLAs are leaving it to the High Command to pick the next CM. The High Command may also hold a secret ballot of MLAs on their preference for the top job. The observers are also speaking to each of the MLAs to ascertain their stand. Bureau Report, India Today.